Mike, let me begin by asking, uh, the town is in a good situation. Eight million dollars, I read in the newspaper, federal funds, I would assume as a result of COVID. It's a nice position to be in. Oh, it's a very good position to be in. The American Rescue Plan Act that the president signed uh, immediately authorized $3 million for the town, of which we received 1.5 already. We're eligible to draw the other 1.5 of that $3 million next July. At the same time, <clears throat> Bristol County received approximately $110 million, uh, and our per capita share is a little more than $5 million of that. So we're working with Bristol County on that. But right now, we're, we're beginning the, to plan and uh, figure out how we're going to execute the $8 million that's about to come into the town. I may be wrong, but I know when the state or the federal government gives money, there, there's usually strings attached, limitations. Uh, how about with this money? Sure. ARPA, right, the American Rescue Plan Act, is going to uh, have certain uh, constraints and restraints that are going to impact how it's spent. Um, but this money came very uh, with liberal regulations and rules applied, much like CARES FEMA money that we received earlier uh, when the pandemic started. Uh, but there are some guidelines that we're going to have to follow when we uh, spend this money. When you have money like this, would your thoughts be spend it on capital or use it on operating? That's always a tough question. It, it really is. Uh, but I think we're developing a balanced uh, strategy and approach that we want to take to town council uh, and work with them on how we're going to deliver this. It's really a mix of economic development, right, uh, and building up some of the assets that we have in the community, right, and making sure we're taking care of some of those assets uh, that we didn't have funding for before. So a little capital, a little development, a little operational, uh, but just that right balance of all of those needs that we have in town. Years ago, the ultimate decision would have been made by RTM. There's no longer RTM. So take me through the process. You decide where you would like to spend the money. Do you then need council approval? Absolutely. Well, town council has the authority uh, for all funding and the uh, obligation of all funds within town. So uh, my job is we pulled together a team here uh, on the administration side, a, a small working group, worked with each of the department heads, asked them what their current needs and requirements were, um, looked into the community what the current needs are, and developed a, a straw man uh, strategy of how this money could be spent. Uh, we looked at several projects, several different things that we had uh, previously kind of either kicked down the road in our capital plan or we had just uh, deferred because we didn't have the funding available. And we put together a, a strategy which I gave an overview of to the town council. So the town council is, is going to have the authority to uh, obligate that money. Uh, so they've actually referred me, referred me back to the finance committee when we'll go in, present the details of all the different projects uh, that we've got in mind and how we think it's going to be worked, get their input. I know that the council president has asked the uh, counselors to come back with their ideas and recommendations and send that to the FinCom so we can have a good debate on how this money can be utilized. Uh, uh, so we'll be into finance and then they'll bring it back to the full town council uh, when it gets back on the agenda and then vote it out how it's going to be used. And of course, government's known for moving slowly and you don't have all the money just yet. Time-wise, uh, what are you looking at? So uh, the initial stages, we do have some money on hand. We've got right now $1.5 million from the federal government on hand. So there are some immediate things that if, if gets approved, we can start spending that money on as well. Uh, but this money ex expands all the way out through 2026. Uh, so we'll, you know, take a look at how best to spend it, where it needs to be spent in town for the right things, for the right purposes.